Hello everyone, I am Lightsaber09 at Gigstra, and today I am going to be uh, doing episode 2 of the Slender tutorial for Unreal Engine 4, The Revival. In this episode, we are going to add foliage to the landscape. We're going to add grass, um, maybe some trees, probably. That sounds nice. So to get started, you're going to want to find a foliage pack. I'm using this one called Nature Package. It's got... Uh, a bunch of different stuff. It's got bushes, it's got grass, it's got rocks and trees, it's got a lot of good stuff. So I'm gonna be using this. You can use anything, a good one. That I used to use is something called like the Kite Demo. It is fairly big. It's like set 3 or 7 gigabytes. But it, it, it also looks really well. That's what I used for the last uh, tutorial. So I'm just going to add this to our project, Slender Tut. <laughs> And add that, and then um, once that's all downloaded, I will get back to you. All right, so our nature package it has been added in. So let's add the grass to the landscape. So what we're going to want to do, let's just make a new folder, and we'll call it materials. Right now, I'll uh, search up the material that used for the landscape. In this case, I use moss. I use this one. We're going to Control C, and we're going to paste it in here, and we're going to call this moss grass I guess um we don't need any of this stuff technically <laughs> I'm doing this in a very very basic way uh before before we do any of that we have to go to project settings and type in experimental I believe or fully, where is it? Alright, so as it turns out, it's actually in the editor's preferences. Um, you can just type in foliage and turn on procedural foliage. That we might not use in this episode, but we are going to use it eventually. Alright, so back to our grass. We're going to need three, well, four things. We're going to get a texture sample. <clears throat> this is going to be the texture that we use. In this case, it's going to be the moss. Uh, uh, these are like the exact same. <laughs> um, we need a landscape grass output, landscape layer blend. I would call it landscape, of course. Landscape layer blend, and then landscape layer sample. <clears throat> So our layer sample, we can just call this grass, and then as well call this grass, plug this into here, I haven't done this in a very long time, I believe this is correct, if you get the layer blend you will plug this in, and now we need to make our, it's not really called foliage, but we'll just make the foliage folder and then call it grass and we have to go to miscellaneous look for grass type which is apparently not here all right it's under foliage here landscape grass type we're just going to call this landscape grass so we're going to i'm going to add two i'm going to add our normal grass so we have some yeah, we'll go grass 101. And then our. We can add some rocks. I don't know how big these are going to be, so we'll, we'll just go with rock one. Now we need to set that. Our grass type is going to be the one that we just made, which is called landscape grass. Alright, save, apply. after our shaders are done. And now we have to set the landscape material to be our new material, which we called it moss grass. All right, um, we have to set this to be one, because otherwise it's just not painting on at all. So that's one potential thing that we didn't do. All right, and the last thing is we actually have to paint the grass on, which is something that I did not know. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know. I've never done this before. Uh, I don't want to touch anything just yet. I've never had to do this before. Which is why I'm not sure what to do. This is all new to me. I'm, I'm figuring this out too. <laughs> Yeah, let's just do that and then Oh. Okay, well we created the layer. Um if you don't know what that is, those are our rocks. So we have to mess around with our grass type grass density. One. Okay, there we go. So we do have grass, we do have rocks. We're obviously going to have to play around with this a lot. Also, those rocks are too big. Grass density, let's go with 0 0.1. Let's see if that's any better. It is. And as for our actual grass, I would like it to be more dense. Uh, 800. There we go. Okay. Um... Yeah, so having big rocks, if you do like the look of these big rocks, you would have to not have it at the grass, because you'll be able to just walk right through these. If it's a small rock, it doesn't matter. So I'm going to quickly search for any smaller rocks, and uh, set those. But basically, that's the whole tutorial. You can just set, like, you can have flowers or whatever. That's going to be the whole thing for the landscape here. Uh, adding grass to it. So thank you guys for watching. I'm just keep messing around with this. I know this isn't the best tour, but that was my first time ever having to work with that kind of stuff. <laughs> so thank you for being patient with me. Goodbye.